In a new interview, Selena Gomez reveals that her giant back tattoo was partly inspired by a nickname that her best friend, Cara Delevingne, gave her. Selena Gomez sent fans into a frenzy when she debuted a massive tattoo of a watercolor rose on her back at the end of 2021. Now, she's finally revealing the meaning behind the ink, which her friend, Cara Delevingne, also has tattooed on her body. It means a couple of different things, Selena explained on Live with Kelly and Ryan. Me and Cara, one of my best friends, I was maybe 16 when I met her, she calls me Rosebud. So it's a nickname. And I've always wanted a rose and now I got one. And I love it. Kara isn't the only friend who Selena has matching ink with, though. I have, actually, multiple tattoos with people who have honestly left a significant mark on my life, Selena admitted. I have one with Julia Michaels and my mom and my best friends. A lot of Selena's mini tattoos are on the smaller side, though, but the pink and black rose takes up a good portion of the top of her back, right underneath her neck. Selena and Kara have, clearly, known each other for years, but they've gotten to spend some extra quality time together lately. At the end of 2021, Kara booked a role on season 2 of Selena's Hulu show, Only Murders in the Building, so they even got to work together. While hanging out in New York City, the ladies even hit up a New York Knicks game in mid-November, and they were featured on the Kiss Cam. Related Gallery Selena Gomez's hottest looks, photos of her best outfits. During the Kelly and Ryan interview, though, Selena was promoting the upcoming Hotel Transylvania movie, which she voices a character for. She looked stunning in a plunging black top for the virtual Q&A, and had her hair styled in a short, sleek bob. The press day followed a New Year's trip to Turks and Caicos for the singer-slash-actress. One of Selena's pals shared a video of Sel having a blast while water tubing on the tropical vacation, which looked like so much fun. It's back to work now, though. <laughs>